Good morning. Welcome back to the Gospel of Luke. We're in Luke chapter 4. Jesus has just uh, been through the most remarkable testing in the wilderness there. And now we're just only this morning, verse 13, chapter 4, verse 13. Here's what it says. Now, when the devil had ended every temptation, he departed from him. Oh, I wish it stopped there. But it says he departed from him until an opportune time. So this has just been a remarkable testing. Go back and watch the last three days if you missed any of those. But uh, notice here, the devil does every temptation. He, he throws them all. And when he has used them up, Jesus has defeated him each, each and every time. Praise the Lord. But he departs. But he doesn't just go away and say, well, I'm never going back to him. You know, I, he, he, he nailed me. He departs until what? Until an opportune time. Now, of course, for Jesus, there really never was an opportune time because Satan is always working. He's always trying to get under his skin and, and, and all that. So I know he comes back and he tries, but but uh, defeating Jesus, uh, who's totally committed to God and filled by the filled by the Holy Spirit, uh, that that was something the devil never succeeded in. But you and I, he comes with quite a bit more success, doesn't he? And so we just need to recognize that after a, a massive spiritual victory, which is what Jesus had here, the devil's going to come back. You know, he he may he may step back, but he'll come back. He'll come back at a more opportune time. He will come back again and again and again. He's going to keep trying. So what we need to do is, is actually rather simple. We need to walk with Jesus again and again and again, day by day, morning by morning. We need to be converted brand new. We need to know him and the power of his resurrection every morning. And that's the way it can be for you this morning. That's the way it can be for you tomorrow morning. Jesus is Lord. I want to walk with him. And so he wants to walk with me. So yes, there are devils. Yes, there are devils on every side. So is the Holy Spirit on every side. So is Jesus ready to help me. And so I should anticipate, yes, there's going to be other incoming. But that's okay, because I'm going to walk with Jesus. And day by day, he will walk with me, and he will help me. And he will be your helper, too. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, the times are intense, the testings, the subtleties that we face today and try to even just to know what even to do day by day. Those are pretty big things for us. So Lord, bless us and help us. Help us to be more like Jesus. Help us to receive all the forgiveness you have for us. Help us to receive all the counsel and guidance and watch closely your examples. And so one thing we learn here, Lord, is that the devil's not going to leave us alone. Certainly not. But that's okay, because as you were with Jesus after this uh, battery of tests, so you will be with us after whatever testing we go through. May we walk with you. May we walk with you each day. We ask that you'll, you'll be merciful to us and keep with us. In Jesus' name, amen. Friend, may God be your partner today. May his blessings be upon you.